We go inside the WCC and take a look at the Portland Pilots before conference play begins. The headline, is it the start of something great? Head coach Terry Porter has brought in nine new faces, most of them freshmen, with the hopes of building the foundation of a solid program. The biggest thing we've talked about is do you want to be a part of something um, special we're trying to build here. Kids are excited about it. We talk about my background as being an NBA player and a coach. We really try to teach and sell a lot about the coaching staff's ability to teach kids um, to be better ba basketball players, be the best basketball player they can be, and um, go from there. I feel like there's a lot more excitement because we have so much more potential with eight, nine new guys, all athletic, great players. So it's there's a buzz around campus that uh, hasn't hasn't really happened in a in a while. The marquee player, Demarcus Tyson, one of just two seniors on the team. Tyson is a veteran leader who's scoring seven a game so far this season. He really uh, came back, I think, um, better in all those areas that we had identified. And so for us and the coaching staff, right away it showed to us that he 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 understands the importance of his senior year, what type of legacy he wants to um, you know leave, and how he wants to compete. What I think he people underestimate with him is he has learned how to play in our offense more and he, he knows how to get to his shot. So obviously we run stuff for him, but he knows how to effectively use that, get good shots. The X Factor, freshman guard Marcus Shaver. Shaver is already averaging double figures in his first year with the Pilots and is expected to produce at a high level when conference play begins. Marcus is just ridiculously quick. It's, it's really tough to keep him in front and I mean, you know that this day and age, we have a lot of pick and rolls and the big guys got to come up and, you know, have tried to keep that guy in front of me for like two seconds and it's it's tough. He, he goes by me quite a lot. The biggest game, the start of the home schedule, December 30th versus San Francisco and January 4th against San Diego. Whenever you turn around a program, I think the important thing is you, you play well at home. That sets the tone. I mean, you want to be able to make sure that when teams come in your building, it's going to be somewhere they feel that it's going to be a hostile environment. It's going to be very difficult to win there and they have to play it extremely well. We're counting down a conference play with an in-depth look at one WCC team every week. The first full slate of conference action tips off next Thursday night.